Hi, welcome to my channel. So today in this video, I will show you the working and testing of this class D to amplifier. It's TPA 3100 15 by 15 stereo channel class D amplifier. So as you can see that here are the markings. It operates on from 8 to 24 volts maximum. Here's the aux input section and these four pins are for right channel input. Oh, sorry, yeah. right channel output and left channel output. So let's do all the wirings first. Now all the wirings done. This is for aux, this is for power input and right channel speaker, left channel speaker. So I recommend you to use the 12 volt power supply. I mean, you can also use the adapter. I'm having this power supply right now. It's 12 volts. So let's turn it on. Please make sure that you connect on the right terminals otherwise your board will permanently damage as you can see that the red indicator light is on the amplifier board is on for the aux input i am using this bluetooth 5.0 module turn it on and uh, Put the aux cable in so it's connected and the most important things two things are left right channel speaker and left channel speaker i'm using these two desk speakers actually one thing i forgot to tell you that uh, the 15 by 15 watts means total 30 watts this module can deliver per channel 15 watts at 8 ohm impedance and I am using the same exact parameter speakers 8 ohm and 15 watts let's connect them Now the other speaker. Now let's connect the Bluetooth. Bluetooth is connected. Now search for the songs. sound is very clear no any distortion and no other any noise just clear sound So its main IC is original and it's not too hot, it's, it's a little bit hot. So this is good amplifier I think for 15 by 15 stereo channel speakers. So this was the review of this TP3100 class D2 amplifier. So if you the sound is very crisp, totally clear, 
बट इट्स नॉट टू लाउड दीज टू सब वो फॉर स्पीकर आर ऑफ एक्सैक्ट सेम पैरामीटर विच दिस मॉड्यूल कैन डिलीवर मैक्स द साउंड इज वेरी क्लियर बट इट्स नॉट टू लाउड एज आई कंपेयर टू other amplifier circuits in the market so if you have uh, and the last thing i recommend you to use maximum 12 to 15 watts maximum not to use 21 volt or 24 volt dc for this so if you have any questions you can write in the comment section don't forget to subscribe my channel stay tuned for the updates